Howdy, I'm at Texas A&M University, College Station, Texas. I'm at the Corps of Cadets building. This is about the last Corps trip. And the corpse, the heartbeat of Texas A&M. This is a Corps of Cadets Honor Brass. 50th anniversary was 2010. Dedication, history, knight, fasces, shield, saber. And over here, they actually have a historical marker, Texas historical landmark, a bunch of bricks. This is Texas A&M Corps of Cadets. Soon after its opening in 1876, the Agricultural and Mechanical College of Texas, Texas A&M, established a Corps of Cadets to fulfill its mandate to instruct its students, all male until the early 1960s. In military science, A&M contributed more officers to America's World War II effort than any other institution, including the U.S. Military Academy. Many of the Corps' traditional activities, such as the Aggie Band, Fish Drill Team and Ross Volunteers have gained national and international recognition. A&M's Elite Corps of, uh, Corps of Cadets continues to dominate the university's unique public image. Texas. Some may boast of the prowess bold of the schools they think so grand, but there's a spirit that can never be told. It's the spirit of Aggie Land. And then there's another one over here. I've seen a female cadet walking around today. All these have, all these bricks are all marked. And here too, all around, all these squares are all bricks with people engraved bricks. So this was dedicated to the 7,000 young men and women who marched in the Fighting Texas Aggie Band during its first 100 years. They were tough enough and proud enough and good enough to be the noble men of Kyle, the pulse of the spirit of Aggie Land. Texas Aggie Band, 1894 to 1994 Centennial. Pretty awesome. It's all kinds of history and it's just a great walk and exercise around the campus. But I mean, the campus goes away from the main campus, goes down roads with different medical, veterinarian, agriculture, engineering. There's a whole hospital several miles away, a hospital school, medical school. And then past that, there's even another campus, the Rellis campus. But I picked a quiet day and a quiet time, which has been great just for taking my pictures and videos and just relaxing without the heavy traffic or students, people walking or bikes.